Hello, welcome back to my channel. I want to talk about my wait list, and um, I started last August. Still on it, and I'm doing quite doing quite well at it. And and I'm going to show you at the end of the video a picture of three um a three colors picture. The top one is the first one. The left is my second one, and my right is my third one, right? But I just want to show you how much I lost all that space of time, and the things I will I've been eating is pork chops and chicken. Get a full chicken, put in the oven, and do it in the oven. Then take the skin off and eat the breast and the leg without the skin. It, on its own, it can't put salt in because I put salt in it because I can't eat without salt. It tastes delicious salt. I eat that on its own. Or sweet corn. You can eat sweet corn from the tin. If you prefer eat sweet corn off the carb, probably more healthy for you. But when I eat take, use the sweet corn from the tin, I always drain the juice from it. I have, car, I, I, and I always eat pork chops, lean pork chops, which is no fat on it whatsoever and and if you're gonna eat bacon do it in the oven top oven because do it in the deep fat fryer or fried the cook fried if you don't use oil but don't deep fat fry because it's full of fat i've cut out fizzy drinks that's called cans Coke, cut out biscuits, I've cut out sweets, I've cut out cakes, I've cut out eating um cheese. Cheese is very fattening. Cut out eating cut down. I've really cut down my bread intake too. I have done to eat the fifty fifty, which is half white, half brown. I don't eat I don't eat Red sauce and all that, I don't eat that. I don't eat. It's more like, I eat, I eat a lot of tuna. Tuna is very good, very high in protein. And I take this. This is whey protein. This is a uh, banana flavor. I um in the kitchen, I have a um, strawberry cheese. cheese. Strawberry cheesecake one, the strawberry flavour, and I'm taking. It tells you what you need. You need 600 ml of. Because it's got to be scooping it and it's got the measure. So you need 600 ml. Mm -hmm. Yeah, something like that. It tells you here what you actually take. It's. You take it with milk, juice. Or say so water, milk or yogurt, but does it just two? But if you're going to do milk, low fat like not the blue one, the green one, the yellow one or the purple one. And it says here when they take it. After training, morning, well well training days, right? After training, morning, afternoon. Don't take it at evening because we ask to it. Rest days after training, don't take it. Rest days, which would be the days you don't take it. And after exercising, morning on rest days, just morning and afternoon. Uh, it has per group. It has nineteen percent protein. And it's the thing to it has carbs in it. You, you push to eat carbs too. Mm. It's there is nine hundred eight grams. Yep. There are nine servings. So it's Holland Barts, but I got two for thirty pounds. It was on offer. So that's the only reason why I was like that. It was on offer two for thirty pounds. Good one then, it's thirty pounds. I know on YouTube I see people with 
46 but different mix because it's way protein. I did this. Um see the banana one? The banana one tastes like ice cream. I swear to god, it does taste like ice cream. And and it really would actually sometimes crave you for ice cream, but you can't eat that either. And even if you're on a diet in the summertime, really, really boosting, you know, a cloud in the sky, and it's like, so like here, like, 50, like, say, 22 degrees, really hot, you really want an ice cream to cool you down, you can't, if you're on a strict diet, like a bodybuilding diet. You can't actually take protein as a meal, if you want, as meals. But... I would one day a week would take this breakfast and lunch and then I'll have chicken or tuna. I would even call it tuna red onion. Take get eat onions. But don't fry them in a in a pot to with oil, just eat them raw. Red onions would be good for you. I never actually ate white onions raw. I prefer the red onions. It's very tasty in it. And see if you were to, I'm not, I found out how to make it so bright tuna. Tuna, red onions, and mayonnaise, right? Get the low fat mayonnaise. If you're going to do that, get the, get the taste of soap waste tuna. Because there's always taste like a bit like vinegary onion. So I know it's a bit wrong. It's low fat man. Mayonnaise is one fattened thing you can eat. But I would just say tuna and red onion. That's what I've been eating. Along with, I've been eating that on its own. Or with pork chops or... Or chicken. You can eat beef too. You can eat beef and long as it's lean, no fat will we'll have fat in it, but long no like would you get pork chops to fat around the edges. But fat thick. We get lean pork chops, there's none of that on it whatsoever. And because chicken has one point not point one grams of fat and pork has not point three grams of fat. And it is this and the strawberry cheesecake one is really lovely too. I never got I never got the plain one because I think plain won't taste very good. So this is me at the moment. Yeah, I know I still got these here, but they're slowing down bit by bit, but my belly, this bit here used to be hanging out to here, past my boobs. My boobs were huge, so that's just me. But you will see on the photo, um, But I know people do this here, but I can't get my own homies to do it. So I like to see the photos, and I hope you enjoy this video. And I hope you, if you like it, thumbs up. If you don't, thumbs down. And oh. One other thing I will say to you, salad along with pork or chicken. Um another thing they would tell you to eat too, salmon if you like salmon, very high protein. And um, but if it, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell to get more of my videos videos coming up. And I hope you enjoy this. Hope this here is Helps you and that kind of thing, and I will see you in the next video. Don't forget to leave a comment. So, bye.